What's happening, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. And today, I want to talk about both Silver Surfer and Roland because both these characters just recently got new uniforms. I know I'm a little late to the party, guys, but I wanted to give you guys my thoughts on it and why you really haven't seen any videos immediately about really either one of these characters. So I'll start with Ronan. Now, Ronan, guys, I haven't bought any of these uniforms just yet, but Ronan is a must-buy, in my opinion, just straight up because of this passive here, or this uniform effect. Increasing damage to supervillains and superheroes by 40%, the target dodge rate to universal type allies is golden. That is god tier, along with the leadership for universal type characters you know being that he's got a tier three you know he can be played in multiple game modes now and you're going to be able to take full advantage of these buffs even if his damage isn't worth a crap this uniform is insane as a support for a universal character so if you're facing something where you can use all your universal characters this guy is going to be gold and going to be so awesome to have and honestly the uh uniform Looks pretty damn cool. If we take a look at the preview here, we'll take a look at what it looks like here. Let's take a look at this thing. All right. Let's check this out. Let's see here. So they're going four, three, five with this baby, right? Woo! That's a major, major delay. Uh, I do believe, uh, which doesn't look very uh, proc friendly at all, does it? Uh, the way they're showing that, that don't look very properly at all, boy. Hell no. Uh, skills are pretty cool, but personally, guys, I don't even... I think, I really think that that's just what he's going to be relegated to because he's going to be such a good support. And that's a good thing because he'll always be a useful character to have. So I would recommend this. I'm going to buy it. You guys can see my crystals. I don't have any right now. So I'm going to have to make a purchase to go ahead and queue it up. But then we also have Silver Surfer. Now Silver Surfer's new uniform is awesome looking. Like this thing is sick. The problem with it though is that, well... It's not a problem. It's actually awesome for a lot of players out there. But for me, as a PvE player, the problem is this uniform is straight up for PvP. I mean, when you look at this thing and you look at the skills and you look at the damage. I mean, look at this, guys. Reflect. Decreased damage received by 40%, right? The revive with 80% of max HP, like... You know, like, uh, seriously, guys, like the leadership, it all says it. PvP, 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 no matter how strong he might be, PvP is where it is. He has a counterattack that has ignore iframe on it. I mean, it's pretty much a given, guys, like seriously. And unfortunately, uh, I mean, he's got a lot of buffs. Wow. I mean, he, he looks really, really strong. Got the accumulation still. That's awesome. But... I do believe PvP is really where it's going to be at for this character. Uh, shout out to Cynic Alex. I already seen Cynic Alex's video, and yeah, it was it was it was pretty noticeable that was the case. You can play with this thing uh, with a proc, right? Which is all good, but I mean, this is one of the uniforms, guys, that I really would build for PvP if I was into PvP. Like I would absolutely build this thing for that because that's really what it's meant for. I mean. It's obvious, and he honestly shines something fierce in that. He's not going to shine on my account, because I don't have a lot of HP on my account. And, well, I just don't really build PvP characters, you know. Uh, just not into it, guys. I find it boring, so I don't really get into it. But his skills look awesome, and he looks awesome. And he has a Tier 4 available, and even at Tier 3... Uh, from what I understand, he's doing really, really good in PvP. Even at Tier 3, even at level 80. That's, uh, that's impressive, guys. That's really, really impressive. But, I don't know if I'll buy the uniform because I don't think I need it. Uh, I know for some players out there, like, if, if you're into PvP, guys, or you want to do better in Timeline, I would highly recommend it. I would highly recommend queuing this thing up, uh, buying it, if you really do care about those things, right? I personally don't, so I don't know. But, it does look awesome. It does look sick. And I have to say, the more that I look at it, the more I'm like, oh, but boy, 1500. Woo wee! Them native tier two uniforms don't play around, guys. They don't joke around, right? Because, you know, the thing for me, guys, is always going to be, you know, 
world boss like world boss is always my thing this is where i focus my attention at i tier four characters straight up for world boss matter of fact here recently i was actually able to go to stage i believe 91 stage 90 i cleared stage 91 today with good old cable right and i'll show you guys that run uh at the end of this video so you can just check it out for fun but yeah he's getting it done guys he's absolutely destroying uh I'll show you the build on my cable real quick before you guys watch that but uh he's got you know mythic uru he's got some Otis blessings on him and fully awakened power bank rock set no artifact uh he's got a mighty ctp of destruction and he's got a legendary uniform so i don't even have a max build but uh yeah he's getting it done stage 91 i'll be using him all the way up till stage 94 but in regards to both these characters uniforms guys i honestly think that uh if you want your universal team to be stronger Ronan's uniform is a must. If you are wanting to do better in PvP, then I think Silver Surfers is a must. But let me know what you guys think, and I do stream on Twitch and YouTube. The link to Twitch is in the description below, and I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching. Y'all take care and have a good one. See everybody. Take care. Come on, bitch, Ola. God damn it. Sit over here. Come on, come on. Let's go, 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 let's go. Run, 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 run. Gather, 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 gather! Go, 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 go! God damn it! I totally f***ed up! I totally f***ed up! God damn it! I totally messed up. Damn it, I lost a lot of damage here. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, That damn proc triggered early. Son of a bitch. Cable's fist skill is such so fucking annoying. Ah. Oh. Get out of there, get out of there, get out of there, get out of there, run, 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 build up, build up, build up, build up, build up, build up, build up. Go, 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 What's up, Ben Spriggs? God dang it, this again, son of a bitch.
go, 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 go. Build up, 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 build up. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Cable, 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 cable. Boom! One minute left. Burn! Stage 91. Mighty destruction. Woo! Of course we're gonna get it, boys. Of course we're gonna get it. You know it! You know it!